It feels weird us already being on episode 10. I feel like we haven't seen 10 episodes, but I guess like when you think about it and you include the uh, the previous arc, then like, I guess that makes sense. But 10 episodes, like it doesn't feel like we're that far into it, but it's also good because we're in a two core, this whole thing's like 23 or four, 20, I think it's 23 episodes. Um, which is good. So we still got plenty to go. We still got a lot of, uh, of show to watch. But, uh, yeah, this is season two, episode 10 of, uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. And I am keen to get into it because the last episode was bonkers. I mean, I don't know if there's a, another word you can use to describe it. I think I have to be that lame and say it was bonkers. Um, it, it was absolutely insane. The Gojo was going off he was killing people he killed uh uh killed um hanami <laughs> that's right and um and i mean was ready to kill all the rest of them i reckon um had to use his domain but only for point whatever point two of a second or whatever it was um and then uh, and I like I think I got the thing slightly wrong and I was corrected on it It was like the the domain was only activated for two tenths of a second or whatever it was um, And then everyone was sort of like frozen while he spent the next like minute or two going through and like killing every single other creature in the area while everyone was paralyzed so um, really really cool and then obviously we had him getting trapped in the prison realm and ghetto revealed that he's not ghetto he's like a different cre there's a different creature in his head that's controlling ghetto's body it's insane so we're gonna jump into this episode maybe we'll get more answers about it i don't know or we might just move on we might jump into uh i i'd, I'd imagine we jump into what um yuji's doing in this episode follow him for a bit but um anyway uh, if you like these videos, if you like my vibe, please support the video. If you can, check out some of the other videos on my channel. And my Patreon account is in the description below if you want the full-length reaction as well as early access, exclusive videos, lots of other stuff. So let's jump into this Season 2, Episode 10 of Jujutsu Kaisen. What the fuck? Is that Megamaru? That face? Yeah, because you got the thing in his ear, right? Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> Immediately threw it away. Yeah. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god. Holy shit. Is this Ghetto actually controlling his body a little bit? Uh -huh. Yeah, because the body's reacting. Hmm, that's interesting. That's really interesting. Maybe the world operates differently based on our techniques. <laughs> Oh god, goodbye Gojo. That's so, such a cool design, are you kidding me? What an awesome design for like a prison. Yep, only holds one, okay. He can kill himself? Pandemonium, okay. You are my special. Ba, 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 Ah, I thought that might have been it in my head, but I didn't say it out loud. Damn. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Who is it? Two of them? Okay. 
Okay. So these are probably two, two that we haven't seen before. Wow, she was quick with that phone. I'm surprised the phone didn't lag. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Okay, follow him. Listen to him. Mekamaru fought to get any sort of, sort of information to you guys. Good. Okay, cool. Okay. <laughs> Is she gonna take his money? <laughs> Yeah, of course. Oh, God. Oh, what the fuck is this? What? Oh, my God. Don't tell me Gojo's causing trouble in there. <laughs> what the hell? What's he doing? <laughs> I love how casual he is in there. So he's just... Like, just his presence being in there is just making the prison cube be, like, heavy and weird. Like, I imagine he can't get out, but it's just annoying. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They have meticulous plans. All three enter simultaneously. Hey. Oh my god! That scared the shit out of me. Oh my god! What? Oh my god! Hang on, is this. Oh my god! Isn't this the dude that's always been like the assistant guy? Or does he just look like him? Is that actually him? Because he's a pretty big character to die. Was that him? <laughs> okay. That was one of Mechamara's things. <laughs> That's cool. Cool. Yeah, so he's making... Yeah, that's so great. He's making it a bitch for them. <laughs> oh, God. This is just awful to watch. Hell yeah. Oh, my God. Animation's so good. Oh yeah, I I love Mappa's animation, man. It's so good for a character like Itadori who just does constant movements like that. Whoa, look at him just scaling a building. He's just gonna shout. <laughs> <laughs> There's Wally, found him. <sighs> That's a effective way to get the information out. That's uh, I haven't seen a show do that before. Get this information to them. They just yell it really loudly. Of course. I hope Nobara peels your face off. Oh shit! There's a little bit of infighting going on. やっぱ俺も板取り殺したいかな。あ、どうや。そうだね。じゃあさ、今の戦力でも勝つ時は勝つってことじゃん。はあ。板取り殺し。He just he's like, "Hey, look, it'll 
A game now? Oh shit. That's interesting. <laughs> okay, Ghetto is guarding the prison realm. And Ghetto, yeah, doesn't give a shit what happens here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is great. I love this. That's a great idea. They're making it a game to find the main character. So we're going to have the main character do some cool shit. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Okay. That makes sense because they knew Ghetto before. They knew Ghetto in JJK Zero. <laughs> That's a bit of a handful. Oh, that's nice. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's true. Yes, yes. This is the All Might thing in MHA. Like, just his existence makes people terrified. <laughs> this is cool as shit. Ah, oh, this is such a fun show. Oh, there's more. Oh. Is this? Agami? What the fuck? Who are you? Don't love that guy. <laughs> okay, that was weird. What a good episode, man. Oh, this arc's really heating up. I, I think this is such a cool idea for an arc. I, I think I'm starting to see why people talk about this. Like people have said for ages, for ages, like the Shibuya arc, I can't wait to see that animated and stuff. I never knew what it what was going to happen, but I kept seeing the show build, build it up and say like Shibuya on October 31st or whatever. That's when we're going to attack. Um, so I've... I've been really excited for it, but I didn't really know what to expect. And now that we're actually like getting into the thick of it, it's really cool and interesting. Um, so the first thing is the prison realm, they, they, he said like something about blah, 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 prison realm, like got to keep active. And there's only one person. Um, un and he said like, unless Gojo kills himself in there. So. Like, and I guess when we saw him, he was kind of just like chilling back and like flicking his um, blindfold. So I imagine Gojo could, I don't think he will, but he could end his own life while in there. So that he's got the freedom to do that. He can't do anything else, but he has access to his own body. I guess it's just, it's basically a jail cell. That's all it is. Um, so, I mean, like, it's just... It's just interesting that they mentioned that. I don't necessarily think it's going to come back, but it would be interesting if, if that did come back somehow. What I do love, though, is that is that the cube, like, they just expected, hey, we're going to seal him in this cube, and then we can just fucking, you know, put it away and carry it somewhere safe or whatever. But Gojo is such a force to be reckoned with that just him being in that cube and fucking around makes the cube drop and stay in place. Like, you can't move it. Hey, he's sealed in there. He can't get out, but you can't move the cube. He's got you in a stalemate. It, I I really love that. And then later when I think Mekamaru was talking about it and he was like, they can't move uh, the cube from its position. And Ichidori goes, why not? And <laughs> Mekamaru goes, because he's Gojo. And, and Ichidori's like, got it makes perfect sense like i think that's the same as the rest of the fan base like everyone going like can we get an explanation for why the cube can't move and the the writer is just going it's gojo <laughs> do you need more explanation than that and we're like no no we don't thank you very much thank you for the answer 
Um, so the like, look, a glasses guy died in this episode, right? And I think I'm just getting the picture of him up. Yeah, this dude, this guy right here, um, it, this is the guy, isn't this the guy that, like, would always help out and hang around? He was, like, the assistant dude. I don't know what his name was. All I remember is that in the English dub of this, um, he was voiced by the guy who voices Gundam Tanaka in Danganronpa. That is, <laughs> that's kind of why I remember this character a bit, because I like the guy who voices Gundam Tanaka. Um, but, uh... But isn't that the same guy? And if so, I know other people probably won't think about it too much, but that's kind of a big deal, isn't it? He's a he's a big character. Like, he was in a lot of episodes. He was helping out a lot. He had some significant character. He wasn't, like, one of the main people we remember all the time and stuff, but he's kind of a big deal. And he's dead now. And he j died by the... the Not the Code Rack guy, the... um. He died by the guy who wants, who holds hands with his sword, right? Like, that's the thing. Like, the sword has a hand as its handle. Um, so he died to that dude? Poor guy. Um, assuming that is the same guy. I'm assuming it is. It looks like the same guy. <laughs> um, I just think, like, the episode felt like it didn't make that big a deal of it, which is why I kind of thought it might not have been him, but I don't know. Um... I, li I like the discussion the enemies had about Tsukuna and whether or not it even matters at this point. Like, Jogo is sticking with the plan. He thinks Tsukuna should come back and it, like, guarantees victory and it starts the Age of Curses or whatever. Like, Tsukuna should be back. Um, but Mahito is like, look, I understand that Tsukuna is, like, an instant victory for us. But at the same time, I feel like killing... Itadori, like I, I want to kill him, and he, uh, and also I think we got a pretty good chance to win without uh, Sukuna, so I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> you know, I think I think that's a, a really fun dynamic because it means the villains have a little bit of infighting going on, but they're doing it in a way that they're still working together. Um, and also it like gives the enemies an excuse to not just wait around the prison realm, but go after Itadori. Um, and then we also have uh, Chozo, who is the third brother, or like the two brothers we killed at the end of last season, he's the third one. Um, and he wants revenge on both uh, Itadori and my girl Nobara. I've got the little Nobara and Android here. Um, and I've got it set up to her holding lipstick. <laughs> um, so they want revenge on Nobu and, and Itadori. Now the thing is, her arm just fell off, Jesus. Um, the thing is, I think if Itadori already has Jogo and um, Mahito coming after him, uh, and Choso wants to get both Itadori and Nobara, I think the, the sensible thing is that it's going to be a Choso, Choso, and I keep looking down at the name because I only wrote his, I only learned his name was Choso in this episode. Um, it's going to be Choso and Nobara fight, I think, and I think Nobara is going to annihilate him, which will be a lot of fun because I love watching Nobara fight. I love, I love her. <laughs> She's one of my favorite characters in this show. If it wasn't for Miwa being in this show, she would be my, my favorite character. Um... But yeah, that's kind of it. That is that is all I had to talk about. But there were, I, that was a lot of stuff to talk about, but I talked about it very quickly. I, I speak quickly. <laughs> but yeah, I'm so excited for the upcoming episodes. That was a great episode. So uh, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to support the video if you can. My Patreon account's in the description below. Go check that out and watch the other videos on my channel if you can. So thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.